What do you want, gringo? What are you doing here? Have you heard? There's a war going on. My name's John Marston. I've been sent here to retrieve a couple of men. Can I speak to your commander? You want to talk to my boss, gringo? I guess. Because I'm not good enough for you? No, sir. You think you're better than me? You come to my country, my poor little country, and you think you can be friends with the president? No, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Things must have come out wrong. Maybe you can help me. You'll be sorry, friend. <laughs> relax! Oh, my God, relax! <laughs> Sure. Somewhere between a threatening stare and the soldiers armed to the teeth. Yeah. Yeah, you had me. Welcome to Mexico, amigo! Let's come me drink. And then we'll talk. My name is Capitan Vicente de Santa. John Marston. My country is in pain, John Marston. Terrible pain. The rebels have seized the people by the throat. Destroy a way of life. I'm no politician, sir. <laughs> and I am uh, no soldier, Aquila. Mm -hmm. But we are both beholding to our time. A brave man. Perhaps you've heard of him. Coronel Alande. He's trying to preserve the order in our province. To keep our civilization alive. But it's tough. People are confused and usually swayed. Sometimes in the service of what is right, you gotta do terrible things. <laughs> it breaks my heart. I also am no moralist, sir. I wish I enjoy your freedoms, Mr. Marston. I'm trying to find a man. An American, an outlaw named Bill Williamson. I believe he came here to seek protection from another outlaw named Javier Escuela. You're no moralist, but you hunt outlaws? So it would seem. You heard anything of these men? I am the government, or what is left of it. Outlaws seek each other. They're possibly hiding with thieves and killers who pose as freedom fighters in the hills around here. They're united under one traitor named Abraham Reyes. Where could I find this Reyes? If I knew, I would be there, hunting him with everything that is true within me. Reyes finds you. Like cholera. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. But it's possible, though. My men are trying to lure him into a trap. Possibly you could ride with us. And if everything goes okay, I'm sure the coronel will help you. Okay. Vámonos! Are you going to ride with me? I didn't know what to expect. I hadn't even crossed the border and I was being shot at. You will never find those men without me, Senor Marston. Mexican friend. Bill Williams is a fella I used to know, and Javier Escuela? 
Well, I knew him too. What do you mean? Do you know this man? We was friends once. Part of the past I can't seem to get rid of. The past is all that's real, my friend. They cannot be erased. That is the problem with the people here. They spend too much time dreaming about imaginary futures. I know I can't change the past, but I'm sure gonna do something about the future. Whatever helps you sleep at night, amigo. My country is full of American criminals, mostly in the service of the rebel pigs. Mexico is an easy place for men to lose himself, whether he wants to get lost or not. Hopefully not too easy. I ain't got much time to find these men. There must be a high price on their heads. The highest price? Can I ask how much? I'm not getting paid. It's... it's a long story. I'm being made to do this. I will never understand you Americans. Me neither. We have a system of law in Mexico, senor. And we do not tolerate people who think they can run with their own. However, if you help us, we help you. No one hides from Coronel Allende for long. It's rebellion. It is a disease. It is killing this country. Don't the people have the right to stand up for themselves? The right? The right? Don't you throw silly ideas at me. What do you know about the rights of the Mexican people? Very little. I'm just saying there must be something behind this rebellion. I'll tell you what's behind there, Senor Marston. Lies. Insidious lies. The peasants are stupid. And like cows, they can be hurting. It only takes a few men to move many. Maybe they've just had enough of being called stupid. You're talking about things you don't understand. If you ask me something, I'm gonna give you an answer. Are you a revolutionary? Is that why you're here? I was once, I suppose. In a twisted kind of way. Thought I could change something if I fought hard enough. Change what? I don't know. Maybe that was the problem. Revolution is always selfish. There is nothing but greed and ego. I thought you wanted our help. Who's this man we're looking for? The leader of the rebels? Abraham Reyes. He's a traitor, a liar, a coward, and a sinner. A hero who has done nothing. I have far more respect for the shit I looked this morning than I ever will for that pathetic worm. That's a nice image. He is from a rich family, a man born in a golden cradle, who pretends to fight for the poor. He's taking advantage of the ignorant and the weak-minded. He must be telling the people something they want to hear. Of course he is. All that bastard does is stand in a balcon, giving speeches. It is easy to make promises you can never keep. It takes more than a few promises to build an army. Reyes wants power, nothing else. He doesn't care about anybody but himself. He's prepared to destroy everything my compatriots have fought and died for, just to hear people shout his name. Were you ever in an army? <laughs> no, sir. I was never in the army. I thought as much. You have the air of a man who knows little of loyalty and this one. And you have the air of a man who's too hasty to jump to conclusions. Do you have a problem with authority, Senor Marston? If you were in the position I am, you'd have a problem with it too. Do you even believe in God? I don't believe in much right now. I'm just here to capture two men, like I told you. Well, believe this. I am the army. And I am the governor. If you want to hunt that loss, I will lay you. Kill them all. You will be doing me a favor. But in this province, in Nuevo Paradiso, you will obey my command. I thought Colonel Olinde was in charge. Ain't you just a captain? When I am, there is not here. I'm in charge. Do you understand me? You will never find a man without me, Senor Marston. Stay with the wagon. Go! Only the bad words. So long as I know when someone's calling me a son of a bitch, that's enough for me. You Americans are all the same. You wish to colonize the world, but you won't learn anyone's language. I think you got us mixed up with the British. Well, I have nothing mixed up, Senor Marston. I'm gonna look at him, man. Where are you going? Get back here! Didn't I tell you to stay with me? If you want my help, you obey my orders. It's not for now. Are you ready? Ready for what? We will lure the rebels into a trap. There's a train leaving to Parosa soon. We're going to school. Come on! The train is waiting.
What are you waiting for? Mind your horse! Come on, this way! Here! Vamos! There is a train! We must escort it to Casa Madrugada! Señor.
Bien, compadre. You did a good thing for Mexico today. Coronel Allende will be very pleased. Los rebeldes están robando el tren. Levántese, perezoso, que se va que le estoy pagando. Marston, you're going to have to do something. What? You have to go out there and start the train before it crosses the bridge. Yeah. Todavía levántese. Ay, Usted joder, también. Y allá para muévase. ¿Qué les pasa a usted? Ay, oh, Dios mío, levántese. Ya mismo. Hurry, the train is getting away.
eres llorón, maricón. Me das asco. Hablas lealtad, pero eres transparente. Estarás aplaudiendo cuando mi cabeza está en pelado, ¿verdad? No, 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 mi excelencia. Mis hombres y yo estamos trabajando noche y día por su honor. ¿Honor? ¿Qué eres, un muchacho? Jovencito, sin vergüenza. ¿Qué diablos es este cabrón? That's, that's the man who helped us defeat Reyes. The man I spoke to you of. <laughs> Afrento, México. Hello, sir. Hola, gringo. So you are the bounty hunter, huh? Have you found your prey yet? No, sir. Ah, uh, perhaps you come to hunt me, huh? Your country loves to make trouble in mine. Perhaps, but it isn't so. Ah, uh, perhaps I should tie you to a horse and let it drag you around town. Or let the dogs fight you, huh? <laughs> then see what you say. I'd say the same thing. I'm here to bring two men to justice, nothing more. Your politics or ideas of entertainment are not my concern. Yeah, I suppose not. Pero son tuyos. Sinceramente, espero que me encontraste alguna compañía más interesante que ese bruja que me traíste anoche. Let me ask you this, sir. Do you know anything of the men I'm looking for? Escuela is from this province. His uh, father was a borracho, a drunk who worked as a laborer on land cultivated by my uncle. Men like that are natural allies for Reyes. My people have lived and worked here for a hundred years. We brought civilization. And these people, these fucking monkeys, despise us. We brought them God! And they turned their back on him. Now I fight to help them from themselves, to save them from themselves. I see in their faces that they would kill me if they could. <laughs> Is she only a tyrant? That is the way it is. These people need a ruler. Well, sorry to hear that. Sorry? Why be sorry? It is a way of mankind. A fight between two forces. Que sara, sara. What will be, will be. But I know one thing, Senor Marston. Force, <laughs> force must be used if you are to have your own way. I'm sure. Now. Perhaps you can uh, do me a favor while I find these men for you. After we find the men, then I'll help in any way I can. Ah, da, 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 da. You are in no position to negotiate. Now, por favor, a bunch of these idiots men are fighting at Tesoro Azul. Now, you head there and you lend your support. <sighs> Baboso, ¿cuántas veces voy a decirte? No ponga detrás de mí. ¿Qué eres, cabrón? No está mi sombra. Vaya. Follow me. We must hurry. some men ahead. We will meet them there. Let's go. Come on, easy up now. Some time ago. We're already late. Come on, let's see if you can write. Come on, you can do better than that. Do you want me to slow down? Listen, por 
qué tardaste tanto? ¿Y quién es este gringo? Octavio, por favor. Cada hombre ayuda. I hope you fight better than this little girl, gringo. Come, let's have some fun. Traidor. No te mueves, cabrón. I heard the little horse crying in that house over there. <laughs> Remember, nobody takes them before Allende. We did all this just to get women for Allende? <laughs> no, that's just a bonus. This village is riddled with rebels. Make sure they don't have homes to come back to. There are fire bottles over there. Use them to burn down some of these houses. And what makes you think I'd do that? You want to find Javier Escuela, don't you? Done. You're helping Mexico. Vámonos, muchachos. Buen trabajo. Yo me quedo aquí para vigilar el gringo, capitán de Santa. Get the fire bottles. Hurry! I do not want to be here any more than you do. Go on. Burn it down to the ground. Good. Now burn another one.
Isn't that beautiful? You really are pathetic. You need to relax. Come back to the villa and sample some of the new girls before they spoil. Hold it, right? Mr. Merson, ride with us. We've been betrayed. What's happened? If there's no time, ride with us. Then we'll find the men you seek. Come. There's a combo waiting for us. Come, we must hurry. Go. Come on. What's the hurry, DeSanta? Where are we going? The rebels have taken control of an abandoned fort on the other side of Nuevo Paraíso. Many men. A place called Torquemada. We can allow them to establish a stronghold. The Coronel has given me urgent orders. Which are? To kill them all. I should have guessed. Ride with me. We have a long journey ahead of us. Come on! Los rebeldes tienen una fortaleza ahora. ¿A dónde vamos a parar? Abraham Reyes tiene un verdadero ejército. Dicen que hay cientos de hombres apostados a Torquemada. Creo que somos muy pocos. Cállense la boca, idiotas. Son campesinos nada más. Y todos se van a morir hoy. Let's go! Now! Captain Espinosa already has men there. We must get to him before he tries anything stupid. Wake up! We're almost there! Keep your eye out! I have a bad feeling about this! Shinimbo! Cover us! We need to get... No! Not now! Mierda! They're behind us! See what mess that idiot Espinosa has made. Is he that deranged captain of the Zora Azul? Is he leading this attack? Me? Espinosa does not lead anything. I thought you was the same rank. He is an angry dog we let out to run sometimes. That is all. I'm in charge here. Follow me. We will leave the wagon here. hombres se habían habido encargado, nos atacaron. Ten cuidado con ese tipo de los mastos. Come on, ignore this cabrón. Shut your mouth off, his boy. Gringo, take that sniper rifle over there. We have been working.
Not shooting! No matter what I guess we ain't gonna be friends now. Adelante! Cuidado! Pinchi pelado! Stand there! That was plain dumb. Go on! Kill them all! Cuidado! Prepare to die, amigo! Los. This way. Mato opresores. Por aquí. Good at this. 
this. Killed me when you had the chance. Vamos, cargamos con lina arriba. Por Dios. Vamos, no podemos fallar. Más rebeldes, disparen. No aguantamos a traidores. I thought we were friends. I ain't got no time for nonsense. Para Gloria. Make me kill him now! Come on, get me on that!
¡Atención! La victoria es nuestra, soldados. Ustedes son todos héroes. Un hombre, lo que sea, mujer. Amigo, amigo, ¿qué pasa? Aquí el IQ, deserves fine women and wine. The best pleasures Earth can give a man. <laughs> I need some information, DeSanta. All in good time. <laughs> uh, my man and I will finish our business here, and so we can talk back at Escalera. The next time I see you, I need some answers, Captain. <laughs> Go get drunk! Go get a woman! Enjoy life! It's a beautiful struggle! <laughs> Andeles lindas, sin patrióticas. Dale, que ustedes son putas y lo saben. Por favor, no me hablas. Oh, mi amor, nadie te está obligando a hacer nada. Solamente quiero que animes al hombre que va a salvar a tu padre. ¿Tú quieres a tu padre, cierto que sí, linda? ¿Eh? What's going on here, Captain de Santa? Just a little recruitment. Nothing for you to be concerned about. You boys using women soldiers now? Our customs are none of your concern. Apparently not. The Santa Mariconcito, me encontraste algunas chicas. Ay, mamacita, ¿dónde has estado toda mi vida? Ve, ve, mujeres. Ay, me gusta. It's two patriots were keen to make your acquaintance, the ah, coronel. Fantastic. I love patriots. Ah, hey, Sergeant Marston, you here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet. I hope so. Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. I wanted to talk to you about it. Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. Huh? <laughs> His Excellency, El Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous. But you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you said Mexico in her fight against forces that would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. Okay, then. Mexico loves you, Mr. Martin. She has a funny way of showing it. Oh, gringo! Ride with us! Vamos! We must leave now! Oye, gringo! Are you awake? Does it seem quiet to you? I don't know. You tell me. We have not seen a single rebel yet. I'd say that's a good thing, wouldn't you? Muertos, cabrón. Una emboscada. Abre el fuego. Oh, hell no. Matenlos a todos. Tenemos que proteger. 
verlos perfectos. I think that is all of it. Buen hecho, padre. That was close. I don't know. This doesn't feel right to me. We're on our way to escort a train through rebel-held country. An ambush feels about right to me. Soldado! ¿Quién eres? ¿Cuál escuadrón? Somos nuevos reclutas, Capitán. Es nuestra primera asignación. I knew I had not seen these men before. They are new recruits. In Escalera, people have been talking about the rebels planning a large attack. If these supplies are so important, why have we been given so few soldiers? Don't ask me. You're the captain. I thought you were supposed to be fearless. I am fearless, but not brainless. There is something wrong. I feel it. Maybe you just need to take a piss or something. The colonel told me that the Santa had praised my actions at Torquemada and called me a hero. He asked for me to be given this important assignment. Why would he do that? The cabron hates me! Yeah, but doesn't everybody hate you? Maybe we should turn back or wait for reinforcements. If Felinde says he knows where I'm... It's another ambush! That was stupid. Not Not by my standards. Estos pedrechos son del gobierno mexicano. This is getting real nasty. Is that our tray? Yes, it seems to be on schedule. At least one thing is going right for us. I agree. We made off to a good start. You shoot well, gringo. Tell me something. What is your weapon of choice? What do you mean? Come, my friend. Your belt is full of weapons. Which is your favorite for attacking a man? We are close to Chuparosa now. I still have a bad feeling about this. Tell me, why are you here? What did they promise you? 20,000 pesos in Javier Escuela. That is a lot of promises. Do you know where Escuela is? You think I am going to tell you that before you have fulfilled your obligations? Do not take me for a fool. I've given you no reason not to trust me. You must understand why we are suspicious of you. Most American vigilantes come here to help the rebels. It is strange you have chosen to work for the army. I'm not working for you. How many times do I have to say this? Call it what you want, gringo. We are exchanging favors then. I ain't seen many favors come my way yet. Abraham Reyes is trying hard to recruit gringos to fight for him. His propaganda is everywhere. He promises women, gold, and of course you go. Money and the chance to interfere in business that is not your own. How can any American resist? I've done everything you've asked of me. If Valinde doesn't give me Escuela and Williamson after this, I think it's best I go ask the rebels directly. Is that the threat? Be warned. You are only alive right now because of me. And you be advised, I don't answer to you, Captain. Here we are, at last. Volados! Abordamos the train! I think we have seen the last of the rebels. You recruits can't win a fight like this. I need you to man the Gatling gun. I ain't the soldier here, Captain. Do not question me, gringo. Just do as I say. Andale! Ojos abiertos! Take your position now! I hope you know how to use that gun. Can't be that hard. Just point and pull the trigger. For Dios! 
We will all be killed! Don't worry, Captain. I've used one of these before. For a cold-hearted killer, you're an anxious son of a bitch, ain't you? We have already been ambushed. Our squad is made up of new recruits and the two men that Santa hates the most. I think it is right to be anxious. Yeah, well, I wasn't exactly expecting a pleasant picnic by the seaside myself. the hill. That was madness. You did well, compadre. Very well. Whatever I can they promise you in return, you have earned it. I don't think the Santa expected us to come back from this. Did you want to kill him, or should I? No. Until I find a squala, he's more used to me alive. Here we are. Thank God. We are lucky to be alive. Go to the camp. The base commander will want to speak to you. Señor Bastón, ven aquí. Oh! Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. 
At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. <laughs> Vamos! Rapido antes and uh, Kenos attack another base. These socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win.